What's up everybody? This is Jose and Katie. Today we are gonna drive through East St. Louis. This city has the highest M rate in the entire country. This place is actually twice as likely for somebody to take you out than in Baltimore, Maryland. Twice as likely. Yeah, this place is twice as deadly as Baltimore, Maryland. And we're driving through at night, so we're gonna see what it's like out here. Um, kind of intimidating. The stop sign is just a sign on the side of the road. It's not even a real stop sign. Terrifying. I mean, the stop sign isn't even up on the, it's just like on the ground with the crowd. Okay. So we gotta be super alert here. Um, there's stop signs. Are people actually stopping at these? There's no street lights. There's just stop signs. Great. Mm -hmm. Are people actually stopping at them? Why do they have stop signs? Are people actually stopping on them? No. This is intimidating. Why are they actually stopping or not? Yeah. People actually stopping on them. That's like the first thing that's confusing is what's up with all these stop signs. Yeah. That car went right through here, okay? So people aren't stopping on them. Mm-hmm. Screw it. That car kind of stopped. Mm-hmm. That's like the first terrifying thing is people are not stopping on them, okay? Mm -hmm. Why do they have a series of stop signs on a two way on a two? Highway. The car behind us, I don't know what it is. It has like police headlights. I'm gonna it got behind us now. That's not cool at all. Mm. Okay, now it got it got behind us and now it's gonna pass us. That's even sketchier. Let's see if it's a police car or not. Just a regular car and he did not stop. Okay, cool. So people aren't stopping at these. They stop enough to see if there's another car coming. coming and then that's it. Yeah. Okay. Sketchy. So that's super sketchy. And that car flew off. Yeah. He's going 60 miles an hour, 70 miles an hour. Mm -hmm. People aren't stopping here for nothing. They're just flying through here. Yep. Like a war zone. Open up the map on your phone. Sure. So it's like a war zone. People don't even stop at the intersections. Here you are. Wow. Complete war zone. You know it's bad when people are afraid to stop. There's yeah. a unicorn just like ours. Mm. Two of them just like ours. We rims just like ours. Mm. At least they have good taste in vehicles. Yeah. We're not even there yet. When we get to 10th Street, okay, I got it. Okay. So now we're kind of like more into the urban part of it. Mm. And again, these stop signs, which people are kind of stopping at, but not really. up with these stop signs mm -hmm. Unbelievable. Like you're going through. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're 
and shit. Like, there's just businesses with like two or three cars up front. That business says open, mm -hmm. but it doesn't even have what is it? A grocery store? What is it? Chinese restaurant. That's it. There's no sign that says Chinese restaurant. It's just Loom's Chop Suey. I think that's self explanatory enough. What is that? Chicken and fish. Ooh. Charged chicken up here. Here's a Walgreens. There's a cop right there. Mm -hmm. Just keep in mind, this is you. You saw how our trip to Baltimore went. Yeah. This is two times more deadly than Baltimore. Mm -hmm. That is terrifying. Mm -hmm. The M right here is over. It's between ninety something yeah. to one hundred something out of a hundred thousand. Give you an idea. That's Mexico's worst cities like Acapulco or in the nineties. Mm -hmm. So driving through here is as dangerous as driving through Acapulco or. Or Mazatlan or Sinaloa or something. Mm -hmm. It's on par with that. Yeah. And this place has like cartel land type violence. This is as dangerous as Sinaloa, as dangerous as Mazatlan. That's scary. Mm -hmm. In 2019, this city had the highest murder rate in the entire country. Mm. What is it this year? Um, I'm not sure what the, the last one that I could find on the internet was 2019. Mm. And that car, car. I love how there's, every business just has three cars. Mm -hmm. Look how dark this is. Like, it's just like randomly dark. Mm -hmm. Little, like that block, everything was dark on. Mm -hmm. I hate the glare we're getting, man. I'll zoom in a little bit, might make it better. There's a stop sign again here, but again, who's stopping at him? Every block has like three cars on them. Might be somebody just chilling or whatever. Somebody walking on the road up ahead. I can just see their shadow. Yeah. Like, where, where are they at? It looks like they went that way. They went that way? Yeah. Wow, the car's flying. You can see downtown St. Louis and look at the arch over there. Look, you can cool. see the arch. Yeah, massive, ain't it? Mm -hmm. This is just blinking. Let's see what goes through it. Mm -hmm. You can see downtown St. Louis and the arch. Yeah, the arch is cool. way to the west. Mm -hmm. What I'm actually afraid of is somebody pretending to be a cop trying to pull you over. Mm. That's actually what I'm really concerned about. Is somebody what's going to be on ninth? Yeah. Tim would have gone right across to the other side. Do you want to go? all the way across to... Do you want to go to the other side? Is that the train tracks yeah. closing? Okay, so we're going to... We're going to go on 9th. 
You can see the arch from St. Louis. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. That's a very cool detail. Let's um. Let's just turn it over here. Let's pull you turn it here. Go down the street. Then more. There's nothing going on down the street. Mm -hmm. Trains crossing over there. This is a random barbecue grill right there. Absolutely terrifying, bro. And again, nothing, there's nobody out, it looks quiet. Just keep in mind the murder rate of this place. The fact that the murder rate here is that high, mm -hmm. that's not something to joke with. It's the most dangerous place you can be in the United States by, by murder rate. We're looking for Missouri, so which is in state. Unless we don't want to throw the flashing lights. Mm -hmm. Look at this dude, bro. Oh, wow, let's look how clean that truck looks. Yeah. It's like ours, but with, but with chrome wheels. Mm -hmm. I'm not putting chrome wheels on our truck, though. I'm not spending any money on it. Good, don't. I'm done spending stupid money on cars. Mm -hmm. City bus right here. Mm -hmm. This car has no lights. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go, are they gonna let me go? That car has no, head, no lights at all. Mm -hmm. No lights at all. There's a bus behind us. It's a one way going that way. All the lights are either blinking. See all the lights are blinking? Mm -hmm. They're not fixed. lights on those people living in that thing. Mm -hmm. Freaking incredible looking. These are housing projects right here. There's someone on the hooks. Yeah, the gotcha, gotcha. I see him, I see him. I see him. These are like projects right here. Mm-hmm. Housing projects. Is there a bridge that goes across? Yeah, um, go ahead and GPS on your phone, St. Our destination? Yeah. I'm actually gonna go down the street, look at projects and stuff. It's pretty scary down this way. You're actually going in the correct direction okay. right now. GPS, uh, our destination. Mm -hmm. but don't talk about what it is, just GPS. Okay. Straight ahead? Yeah, keep going up to a street called Pigot. I love how cars don't have their lights turned on. A lot of them don't. Mm -hmm. They just have the fog lights turned on. I don't know if that's a local thing that means something. This car's driving kind of crazy. Is this a one way now?
people shown here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is where we need to be. Right here? This is our street. In half a mile, keep left at the fork. Follow signs for I-55, I-64. Just a, a hangout spot or something. Left or right? Left or right? Did you see the road? It's blocked. Left or right? Yeah. And this is a one way. Shoot, that car kept going? Head southwest on South 13th Street. What's that for? Avenue, potholes? Then turn left onto Tudor Avenue. Th that car you went You have to get on left onto Tudor Avenue. Then turn left this onto South 14th Street. This, right here. this is like West Montgomery. Freaking terrifying. So there was a way to go that way? Yeah, you have the road. Look, there's like roadblock things up there. I know, but people are going through. Okay, now we know we can go through it, but I wasn't gonna go in through it and then look like an idiot not knowing that you can't go through it. Mm -hmm. Head so northeast on South Thirteenth Street toward Pickett Avenue. So what is then that? There's just, there's just potholes in the Avenue. road, and that's it. Mm -hmm. Turn left onto Pickett Oh, I see. Avenue. You can't go down that way. Yeah. Well, I can't tell. Okay, we're that is impressive. Yeah, we're, we're gonna go underneath the arch. We're gonna go underneath the arch, man. Yeah. I'm going to record another video. 